Hi everybody, I know it's the same day as I posted the Anything 2.0 from May. Um, well, today I shall be giving you the tutor for both intros. Uh, it's supposed to be a duet actually. One's played by guitar, the other's played by piano or another guitar. Basically, I shall be teaching you the easier one, which is the one that has no chords, but is uses num uses your fingers to get a certain number. Okay, let's start at, off at the high E and the B, and we slide all the way to the ninth fret over here. We leave our pointer finger on the B on the ninth fret. Then we take our third finger to to the high E string, which is the eleventh fret. And basically, we just want, and after, you want to do, and after that, you take your pointer finger off the ninth fret of the D string, move your third finger down, and then you want to hear this noise. So, let's just review. Okay. Then, we take our pinky. We take it onto the 12th fret of the B string. So it goes. Okay. Then we just repeat everything we've learned except for the pointer for the starting off pointer finger on the B9. So it then just goes like this. And the third part is basically just the first part put into the third part. So if we just review real quick. And then the final part, put your first finger on the 12th fret of the B string. And then your second finger on the 14th fret of the high E string. So it goes... And if we play that all together, we get... Now this the the main three chords you want for this is E and nine. And if I'm pronouncing that wrong, you guitar players who are watching, very sorry. And you also want to know F sharp and B. You want to start for, with the A added nine, and you want to play it in a strumming pattern like. Sorry, that's the wrong strumming pattern. But you'll, if, I'll play it for you right now, and say in the comments and write down the pattern, if you can, figure it out. And you want and if you heard me do that, those last three strums of even pattern, that, as soon as you hit the third one, go to the F sharp, which is, your first finger basically covering the whole second fret. Your second finger going to G string onto the third fret. And then your third and fourth are both in the fourth fret. Just one is in A and the other is in D. So you get. And B is just the same positioning, just your pointer finger would be all the way in the seventh fret. That means you would get and then you do that one more time, then you move on to the verse. Now we're not gonna study the verse in this video. I was just trying to do the first few intros. So we got it off with So if you have 
a person, a friend who plays guitar and you play piano, you can do that duet. If you have a person, if you both play guitar, you could do this duet as well. As long as it's a piano and a guitar, this will be easy. And have a good night.